my position card says prep master one. So it's my job to prepare orders placed by the cashier in the order that they came in. So this one came in last, so it's going to be filled first. So let's make a feature entree. Our feature entrees are kept over here, and they're always served either with rice or with side salad. If it's a chili or something like that, it's served with rice, and if it's a pasta like we have here, it's served with a side salad. So you have your scoop, you have your one cup measure, and you put that on your plate. Then you take it over here, and you make your side salad, which consists of salad greens, salad topper, and whatever dressing they wanted. And then you have your entree. The next thing on this order is an agora sandwich on whole wheat bread. So our bread will always be kept up here, and we have three different kinds. Flax, whole wheat, and white. This customer wanted whole wheat bread. So we always toast our bread before we make sandwiches. And then when your toast is done, you want to check it and make sure that it's not frozen. Then we take our bread over here. An agoric sandwich consists of salad greens, mozzarella cheese, and hummus. Hummus. Salad greens. And cheese. a delicious sandwich. Oh no, there are crumbs on this plate. We need to put it on a clean plate before we serve it to customers. Clean plate. Sandwich. Remember, presentation is key. Now we're gonna make soup and toast. So this person ordered whole wheat toast. We go over here. You want to put the toast in first so that you have time to make the soup. So for soup, you get one of the larger bowls and you put two ladlefuls of soup. Then we go back and get our toast. So now you have your soup and your toast and this customer ordered butter on their toast. So the butter will be kept by the toaster. You want to spread it on not too thick, but not so it clumps. And then once again, cut your bread into triangles. You have your soup and your toast arranged nicely. Now let's fill an order for oatmeal made with water. So the oatmeal is made in these pyrex glasses, kept under the microwave. The oatmeal is kept up here. Take half a cup of dry oatmeal mixture and put it in the Pyrex glass. And then because they wanted water, you fill to the two-thirds line. Then you put it in the microwave. For one minute. So while we're waiting for the oatmeal in the microwave, we can go get a bowl. We have three kinds of bowls. Yogurt bowls, 
medium oatmeal bowls and large soup bowls. You want to use a medium bowl for the oatmeal, but if you don't have any medium bowls, you can use one of the small yogurt bowls. So we have our medium bowl, and when our oatmeal is done, we're going to put this oatmeal topper on it, which consists of raisins, cranberries, and sunflower seeds. I think our oatmeal's done. We check our oatmeal, stir it to make sure it's the right consistency. We have pictures over here. And if it looks like that, you're doing it right. And we put our oatmeal in the bowl. With a third cup of oatmeal topper. <laughs>